Hey YouTube, it's Ashley3G here with a review of the ID case by Casemate. I've been using this for a couple weeks now, I think, and it's coming really handy, I have to say. I take it to work where I don't usually take a purse, so what I do is I usually just throw my ID in a bag and, or a backpack, and I also put my debit card in there, and then when it's time for lunch or time to use the card, I just pull the card out of the backpack and put it in my pocket. But what I've been doing with this, this case has allowed me to just have my ID and my debit card. I throw the phone in my pocket and then when it's time for lunch I just go down and buy some lunch and you know that's that. So it's come in handy. I use it a lot more than I thought I was going to. I thought I was just going to use it for maybe nights out, um, you know, going to bars when you need your ID and maybe a debit card for drinks and stuff like that. But actually it's really come in handy. I've used it, you know, instead of a purse or a wristlet is what I, what I usually use. I've just carried it into stores. You know, it's in my pocket. I have my driver's license and I have my um, debit card. So it's worked out really well. And because I'm giving this away, I'm going to go ahead and order another one. I'm pretty stuck on it right now. I wanted to mention that it is designed kind of like a barely there. And so this chrome bezel is exposed. I've talked about that before. But I wanted to add that, honestly, if you're really careful with your phone and you don't lay it down like, like I'm doing right now, unless you have a microfiber, if you don't lay it down like that because you know your bezel is exposed, but you lay it down on this side, you're really not going to have a problem with scratches unless you're in um, some kind of situation where you have dirt, dust, debris, and all that kind of stuff. Then you might opt for more protection. But I'm finding that the iPhone is more durable than I thought it was. And as long as you're fairly careful with this case, you don't have to worry about your chrome being exposed the way that it is with this case. It's really easy to put on and take off. I think I've showed you that before. I did want to say that if you saw the unboxing, first of all, you saw that I put this white, it's called the Easy Slide, is what Casemate is calling it, and it kind of protects the back of your phone from scratches with the cards going in and out of there and whatnot. I wanted to say two things. Uh, Casemate contacted me shortly after the video and told me two things. One is that the easy slide should come in one piece, not two. If you look closely, you can kind of see the line there where for some reason the easy slide was cut into two pieces and I kind of had to piece it together. And they also told me that these come with a black easy slide and a white easy slide. Obviously the black would be for the black iPhone like I have and the white would be for the white iPhone. I did notice that immediately after I did that unboxing video when I was putting everything back in the package. I saw the black easy slide and I kind of felt like an idiot for not kind of getting that it could go on the back of the black iPhone and not show through the case. But really you could use either color. It, it shows through very minimally. minimally. I'll show you what I mean. Let's see. It shows through at the very bottom. Now my ID is white so... Let me take that out and show you what I mean. Alright, so under my debit card, you can see this white strip here. If I had used the black easy slide, then that would be black. You know, it's not really that big of a deal, but I did want to let you know that it comes with two colors. And it is not supposed to be split down the middle like that. Easy access to your buttons on the sides here, just like a barely there, very light in the hand. And I will say that this might even feel better than a barely there just because of this little additional place right here for the cards. It offers a better grip, in my opinion, in my hand. I like the way it feels. The matte finish is really, really nice. It's really smooth. It's kind of like the iFrogs Lux, if you know how that feels. Just a really nice finish on this thing. I'm telling you, I'm addicted to it. Um, I can't believe that it's one of my, well, I can believe that it's one of my favorite cases because the barely there clearly was, but I really didn't know that I would use it as much as I have, as I said before. I don't find any cons with this. Like I said, I've been heavily, heavily using this, and there are no scratches on the back, nothing. You know, the thing is pristine, and like I said, I've taken good care of it. I've kept it in my pocket usually, and I don't lay it down on this side. My bezel is perfectly fine. I'm going to peel the easy slide off the back once the review is over 
and I'm sure there will be no problems on the back of the phone but casemate really thank you for sending this to me you guys keep watching because I'm giving this thing away I just hit 300 subscribers so I'm gonna be giving away three cases I'll probably post that giveaway video tomorrow but this is a case you definitely want to get on one more thing I want to say about this easy slide protective film is that it works with a ton of cases I've used it not that the iFrogs needed it, but I used it with that. I used it with that Griffin New Form that I just reviewed. It slides right in there nicely. I don't think that I tried the NK slider with it. I know that the candy shell would work with it, but just for any case that you feel would scratch the back of your phone, having this on there is really um, reassuring, I guess, that you're not going to get scratches. So, I don't know, maybe Casemate a heads up you could sell these things and people would buy them just for that protection on the back you know sell the black sell the white and people could use their cases and uh, th they're scary cases I guess you could say the ones that that you are a little leery to use you could put this easy slide on there and not worry as much about your phone getting scratched so I don't know maybe if they start selling those I would pick a couple up um, actually, I definitely would pick a couple up. So just an idea. Thank you guys for watching and keep watching.